Welcome back. Now, the last time I showed you how to log into WhatsApp and I didn't go further into other details. Now, after you log in into WhatsApp, this is the screen that you're going to see. You will see here the WhatsApp home. That is the page where we are at. And then you will see another tab here, which is written courses. And then at the top right corner, you will see your name. And then this one, the logout button. You will use this to log out every time after you use WhatsApp. Now, let's get to see what happens in the WhatsApp home. You will have three divisions. The first division is your tools. And then the second division, the middle one is announcements. And then the other one is courses. Let me start with the courses one first, because that's where we need to, to know for now. Now, under your courses, you will see all of the courses that you have registered for the current year. Make sure that all of these courses, they are the courses that you have registered for, and they are the courses which appear in your proof of registration. If there are courses which do not appear here, but they are in your proof of registration, please take your proof of registration to your lecture for further assistance. It is very important that the courses that appear here should be the ones that appear in your proof of registration. Now, in the middle one, we have announcements. Every time a lecturer posts something or the institution posts something, it will appear here under announcements. It will also be pushed onto your app that you have downloaded it on the, on the other video. Now let's get back to tools. I saved the tools for late because they have the most. Now you have announcements under tools. It is the same as these ones. And then you have your calendar. When you click your calendar, it will show you what's coming, like your tests, your exams, and so forth. You have your tasks. When you click your task, you're going to see your assignments. You're going to see your tests, upcoming tests. And then you're going to see your grades that's how how many how, uh, the marks that you will be getting and then you're going to be able to send email the use directory address book personal information and then goal performance and your goals now you, you need to be able to use all of these so that you stay up here in wsu is as wonderful as possible 